Young mother and army veteran is the victim of a deadly crash on Roosevelt Boulevard overnight. The boulevard, long known as the most dangerous road in Philadelphia, with 21 fatal crashes in 2018 and nine this year, including this one. Eyewitness News reporter Crystal Cranmore spoke with the victim's boyfriend. She was just a loving person. She, she cared about, she took care of our daughter for the past few years, like super mom. Now Zuriel Campbell needs to find the words to tell his two-year-old daughter her mother will not be coming home. Philadelphia police say 23-year-old Lashara Rankins was killed in a fiery crash on Roosevelt Boulevard near Grant Avenue around 1.30 Sunday morning. At around like 4, 4 a.m., cops woke me up out of my sleep, knocked, my, knocked on my door, and they told me that she's been in a fatal car accident. Um, um, and then they gave me her military ID, which is all like mangled up. That's why we came here to see what's going on and to figure out where we go from here. Police say a 39 year old male driver rear ended Rankins, whose car appears to have slammed into this tree before catching fire. We're told the Army veteran died at the scene. One of the vehicles, the striking vehicle, was traveling at a high rate of speed from witnesses. Police say he was critically injured and taken to Jefferson towards El Hospital. Campbell says Rankins went out around 10 o'clock Saturday night. I just went to sleep, figured she'd just come back home. Police told the Campbells Rankins' body was burned beyond recognition. The cause of the crash is under investigation. In Northeast Philadelphia, Crystal Cranmore, CBS3 Eyewitness News.